Hey guys, it's Ian, the Off Kilter Crafter. I hope you're having a great day today. Today, I'm gonna be working on this card again. This is going to be a kind of redo. Many of you have asked me to go back and rework this card. Um, this was the 10 minute card challenge that I did with a whole bunch of other YouTubers and Periscopers. If you wanna check out those videos, make sure to go click up in this corner right over here. It will take you to the video that I did that put this card together in 10 minutes. Well, I didn't really make it in 10 minutes. I didn't do so well in the challenge, but um, this is what I came out with and I wasn't really happy with it. So like many of you suggested, I now have time and I'm not setting a clock and I'm just going to go ahead and try to do this without any pressure from trying to get it done all in 10 minutes. So I'm gonna set this one off to the side and we're gonna go ahead and get started with making this card without the challenge of 10 minutes. It's still gonna revolve around this um, card sketch. It had the main card panel and then the diamond shape and then our little rectangular shape here. So I'm gonna go off of this sort of design for my card. The first thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and run this. This is um, paper. It's handmade paper, I think. Um, has a really great texture to it. And I know it's probably not coming across camera all that well, but I really love how this paper feels. I'm gonna go ahead and use one of my favorite dies right now. I always seem to be going back to this die recently. Um, I just, I love it. It's the stitched rectangle die from Simon Says Stamp. And I'm gonna go ahead and run this through my die cut machine. So there is the base of it. I'm gonna go ahead and attach it to my card so that way it is already attached and ready to go. I gotta remember that my card was horizontal in shape. So let's go ahead and stick this down with some score tape. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and grab some of these Tim Holtz. This is Blueprint 1. I'm gonna use the party stamps and I'm gonna go ahead and use this present one. This is some paper that my friend Danielle made and I think I'm gonna stamp this present on it and I'd say like right about there. No, it's gotta be a diamond shape, I forgot. So let me cut this into a diamond shape first. So now that I've cut this square down, I'm gonna go ahead and put this on my acrylic block, which I've already done. And now I'm gonna use my Versamark ink pad and ink it up and then stamp it and heat emboss it with my white super fine detail embossing powder from Ranger. Next up, I'm gonna be using this stamp set. It's from Simon Says Stamp. It's Your Birthday is the name of this stamp set. I think I got this stamp set for free when I entered the code correctly. And I'm gonna be using this Happy Birthday stamp from the stamp set. This is the first time I'm using it. So I'm gonna try and condition it a little bit before I actually put it down onto paper. I'm gonna grab some paper over here and I haven't quite decided what color I wanted to use yet. I think this is, since this is kind of like blue and purple, maybe I should use a purple. So I'm gonna stamp this with VersaFine ink. I have the feeling that I'm gonna end up going ahead and heat embossing this as well, but I think for this moment, we'll see how it looks just in the VersaFine ink. That doesn't look half bad. I'm actually surprised with how good that came out. You know, I looked up and realized that my camera had stopped recording. I need to pay more attention to that. Here are the two cards. Here's the one I did in 10 minutes. Well, actually it wasn't done in 10 minutes, it was, done 10 minutes and a little extra. This one, I don't know how long it's taken me. I'll look back whenever I'm editing this video, but I love this one a lot better. It's a lot nicer, a lot more polished, and not so slapped together. So let me know how you think I did. Coming up right about now, boom, there's a little box. Fill out that poll for me. Let me know what you think. Did you like my first card better, or do you like my second card better, or do you not like either of these cards? Let me know just for fun what you thought. That's gonna do it for today's video, guys. Don't forget, if you liked today's video, hit that button down below that says subscribe. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. That way you can get great updates, just like this one every time I post a new video. 
Also, don't forget guys, hit that thumbs up button. That lets YouTube know that you liked my video and then we'll share it across YouTube land. Also guys, you can get social with me over on my social media, Twitter, Facebook, Periscope, Instagram, all sorts of different places. Make sure to check that out. All of those are going to be listed down in the description below. Oh, and the light goes out. <laughs> well, I guess that's going to do it for today's video. And remember, guys, keep it off kilter. Bye!